Statistics and risk, what does it all mean in health? You're at high risk. Your weight's too high, you're at a high risk of this. Your blood pressure's too high, you're at risk of a heart attack. Well, I hear people say, I know Mary, she's smoked her whole life, uh, fit as a fiddle, she's 99, and she's still going. We all know that smoking's bad for you, how could that be? I think we can understand risk there, that yes, smoking is bad for you, um, and it increases your risk of disease, but it doesn't mean you will get that disease, it just means you're more likely to. Uh, the other story goes about Bob, Bob the triathlete. He was down at the beach, he went for a swim, then he ran, um, then he hopped on his bike, and then he went for another swim. Um, he went up and had some carrot juice um, and a bran muffin, and you wouldn't read about it, but he dropped dead, uh, which just goes to show you exercise is bad for you. Well, no, um, bad things can happen to you when you're healthy as well. Um, it's possible. Um, but less likely. Um, in medicine, I call those things Volvo statistics, explaining away health with case studies. The story goes about Jerry, who has just bought a new Volvo, um, and we know Volvos are very safe cars. In fact, if you're in an accident, it's probably the safest car to be in. Hang on to that word, probably, um, because he's, 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 he's driving down the road and he gets cleaned up by a semi-trailer. Don't worry, he's all right, um, but his car's a mess. Now his neighbour's in the market for a new car, and heck, he's not buying a Volvo, because you should have seen the mess it was made of by that semi-trailer. Uh, that is case study statistics, not taking into account what we call risk or probability. Volvos are safe cars. Um, they've got airbags and pillars coming from here, there and everywhere, um, and it's the best thing to be in. The same goes for your health. Let's put ourselves in the best and lowest risk category, not the highest risk. Yes, you can live your whole life and smoke um, and drink and be stressed out, and not exercise and be overweight um, and nothing may happen to you but the chances are it will and likewise you can be as healthy as you like and you can still have something um, health wise happen to you but it's all about managing and understanding what risk is um, not going by case studies.